take time to thank the neighborhood council for putting this together, the Lafayette Club, and really everyone for coming out tonight. I'm not an elected official, so basically I want to talk about what you can expect from, from me. As a city councilor, I'll road to ensure the safety and well-being of the citizens of Lowell. I'll have the courage in these tough economic times to invest in a Lowell Police Department, ensure the department is properly staffed, officers properly trained and equipped, to allow the department to realize its potential and to meet the demands of today's society and its unique problems. As a council, I will support tougher ordinances to protect our citizens, especially our children from violent criminals, such as convicted sex offenders. I will continually seek out, or I ask the law department, to seek out new rulings that legally enhance the safety of our citizens from convicted criminals while observing their rights to live in the community. As a counselor, I'll act to ensure these ordinances are not restricted to the libraries, but include areas such as schools, parks, and senior centers. As a counselor, I'll not only support, but insist on partnerships between the police department and other departments such as code to close down buildings that harbor criminal activity and destroy the quality of life in our neighborhoods. The safety of our residents in our business community can never be underestimated. The basic principle of feeling safe in one home or business can never be compromised. I'll support ordinances to place legal curfews on young offenders of violent crime. But I will insist the city work closely with the courts to ensure any curfew is corrective in nature so as to give any young offender the opportunity to turn his or her life around. I'll support programs that partner local police Schools, state agencies such as courts and DYS to help identify and monitor at risk youth before they commit an offense. And I'll continue to support the efforts of the local police, the neighborhood groups to enhance the quality of life in the neighborhoods. Thank you. I want to thank everyone for attending tonight. I want to wish Stacey Haggis, who's here tonight, a uh, happy birthday. There's Stacey. You know, there's no more important factor for any public official than to maintain a safe neighborhood, maintain a safe city. Public safety is always number one. And um, I will fully invest in the Lowell Police Department. You know, as a mailman, I've walked the streets of the city for 30 years. I've seen neighborhoods where people get up in the morning, they, they enjoy a great quality of life, and I've seen neighborhoods where people can't walk to their cars. And I've seen the change come when the police come in, they work with the neighborhood groups when they work with citizens, when they have eyes out on the streets, when businesses are involved. And that's one thing I hope to promote in this city is a cooperation between the police, the neighborhood groups, the citizens. Get them involved, get the businesses involved, clean up the city, and start making this a community and not just a city. Thank you.